cat. It's going a little bit crazy. He's done it again, guys. Fre Frederick, look how close your foot is. I don't know why I'm always telling you guys what the time is, but I just am. Um, it's just turned 10 o'clock and me and Frederick are going to go to our swimming lesson today. He's actually currently asleep on the couch. He just passed out at like 9.30 on the couch. I'm just about to wake him, but I'm just going to put the bag in the car so we don't have to do it. While Frederick's asleep and I'm just going to try and make him sleep a little bit longer. Hopefully, wow, I pick him up and put him in the car. But yeah, today I think we've just got swimming lessons today. I was meant to go to the gym this morning, but I didn't go. So sometime today I do have to do a workout at home. Because um, I didn't go to the gym today and I really needed to go to the gym today, but I just didn't go this morning I don't really think we have anything else planned for the day I was hoping we could probably go to a park um, To have a walk around, but I just don't know where and then I was thinking to go to a um, what's the word? A farmer's market, but there's none open today, which sucks. I thought there would be because it's Monday and it's a school holiday still, but apparently no, no farmer's markets are open today. Let's wake up this little munchkin of ours. Ready, darling. Uh, at swimming lessons so i will check in with all of you once we have finished our little <laughs> swimming lesson frederick's all excited now but yeah we'll check in with you guys when we finish so we just finished at swimming lessons i'm still half in my bathing suit because i was just going to just like chuck on a towel like i normally do but Frederick's got some clothes on that I want to take photos of and I found a graffiti wall just down the road from here so we're going to go park across from it and we're going to try and go take some photos quickly before Frederick falls asleep. Your hair! It's going a little bit crazy. <laughs> Look at it from this angle, it's so funny. <laughs> I still don't know what colour hair he's going to have guys. It was, it's weird, when it's wet it looks like my colour but when it's dry, it looks white. So I don't know if he's gonna be redhead or not. I still don't know. Me and Frederick are now home after a little photo shoot, you could say. Where's my phone? And I'll show you a photo of what I took of Frederick. So super cute. I don't even know where my phone is. Don't you hate that when you, you put your phone somewhere, it's in the bag, you put your phone somewhere and you just lose it and you just don't know where you put it. So this is the photo that I'm working on at the moment. But look how cute it is. It's so cute. So we found some cool graffiti walls, but all the graffiti was like, I don't know, like they obviously had graffitied over the graffiti. So it was just like all mitch matched, but it was still really nice. But we had to get out of there. Um, we couldn't stay for very long. I only got a few photos um, because I saw this giant moth. It was like this big, no joke. It was like the size of my hand and it was just sitting on this leaf and Freddie was getting closer and closer to him. And I was just like, nope, we have to go. I don't care if we've only got two or three photos. I have to go because this moth is freaking me out. If you know me, I hate moths. Moths are so scary. Even though the little, little ones, I think it's the flapping. It's the flapping of the wings. I don't like. We are making some lunch. I am making some baked potato fries. And then we're going to have some sausages. And I'm just going to go make some vegetables also because we need some vegetables in our lunch today. So we're going to add some vegetables into it. <gasps> Look at all those vegetables. Wow. Oh, you want those ones? Okay. Ta. What other ones do you want? Those ones? Thank you. 
Any more? Can you reach one? Which ones? Oh, that's ice cream. Guys, I have to show you something. It's like freaking me out so much. Freddie just literally gave me the biggest heart attack. You wouldn't believe what he just done. But I have to keep my eyes on him now. Because Frederick has become such a crazy climber. Like he climbs on literally everything now. And you wouldn't believe what he's climbing on right now. And how high he just got. He's climbing on the cat frame thing and I was just sitting on the couch and I saw his head here he stood on this and he's like peeping through here like hey mum and he'll just climb up I'm at because he'll see it and he'll be like oh I remember that thing I climbed that just before it's dangerous this climbing stage so dangerous and now that he's like he's found his legs so so well and he can literally climb anything he puts his mind to he will climb it and I hate the fact that he's a climber. He's done it again, guys. You climbed up there. Be careful, you are very high. Can you get down now? Please? Please get down, you're very high and you're scaring your mummy. You're really scaring me, darling. I can't believe he got up there, guys. At least he's not climbing through that little thing. Do you want to come down now? Come on. Oh, please be careful. You're scaring mum. Fred Frederick, look how close your foot is to the edge. This is not a laughing matter. This is scary. He's going straight back for it, guys. How do I stop this? I don't know how to stop this. Because it's too dangerous for him to climb on it. And it's not like I can put a baby gate on this. It's like a whole wall. Oh my god, I don't know what to do. He sees Lulu up there and I think that's why he climbs it. Because he sees Lulu. And then Lulu jumps off it. You're going to hurt yourself. Plus, those steps are like perfect size for Freddy. And that is how he gets up. So it's been a little while since we last seen you guys, but basically we haven't been doing that much around the house. I did move the cat frame outside because it was really scaring me. So I needed to move it outside, so I did that. But now I need to put something there because it's so bare, it's so empty and empty. We also spoke to Jason, which we've been, I spoke to him for like 45 minutes or something. Um, and yeah, we talked to him because he was meant to come home on Wednesday after they're changing his flight from coming home on Saturday. But now they think he's going to stay until Saturday. So it's, it's so confusing. I just want him home. Other than that, nothing really has been going on. Frederick still has not had a nap today. He slept for like 15 minutes in the morning, which you guys saw, but that's all he slept. He's only had 15 minutes today and he's just killing it. He's just like, no, I don't want to sleep. I tried to put him down at about 1.30. He didn't want to have it. Like he didn't want to have it whatsoever. He just wanted to stay awake, so he did. And now he's, he's just a champion, guys. Absolute champion at staying awake when he needed to be asleep. Are you gonna go to sleep, pumpkin? She's sleeping inside for once. She's sleeping inside. You can't go in there, darling. Where's Lulu? Yeah, right there. That's Kitty. So we've just come outside for a little bit to just burn some energy off Frederick. And fingers crossed it will help with sleep time, but I doubt it. I very much doubt it. He's having too much fun in there and not out here. I just want to lay outside. 
peace and quiet. But I've just got these two munchkins. They are pretty cute together though. God, it's so nice to just lay on the grass and look at the sky. I didn't realise how good it is, but it, it is. It's really nice. Want to know what I'm looking at? Blueness. Complete and utter blueness. It's so nice to see the trees in the wind. Let's just look at this for a couple of minutes. Okay, we're done. Anyway, guys, we might actually head off for the day. So I hope you all enjoyed this vlog. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and let us know what you thought. Also, I hope you all enjoyed your day or are having a fantastic day. And I guess we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.